I do want to point out that your great grandfather, though, was a prime minister of Canada for, for 18 very months, briefly, yeah. very briefly, yeah. and was part of the Pacific scandal that brought down Sir John A. Macdonald, which you in fact played. So, your family was part of the specific. Pacific scandal, and you played the man who was brought down. Now, I find that certain synergy. Well, I don't know that that's true, that he brought Sir John A. Macdonald down. I think John A. Macdonald had a lot of himself to blame in bringing himself down. By that time, he was probably so bucolic and so drunk that he didn't know what the fuck he was doing anyway. And he needed people like my great-grandfather to help run the country for him. It was something about a telegram that was published a private telegram or something. Yes. In those days, they didn't understand that, although they were much, they got to be much more lenient about bribery, but they had, you have to bribe if you expand. And the, the expansion of the Canadian Pacific Railway was a mighty important thing. They couldn't raise the money here. They had to go to America to get Jay Cook to come up and help build it. And that was Sir John, and my great-grandfather, and Sir Hugh Allen, who then was the richest man in the country. And they, they uh, commandeered Jay Cook. That didn't work, because suddenly that was the Pacific scandal, that they went across the friggin' border to get some help. <laughs> I've never understood that. If you're raising money, what does it matter where it comes from, particularly if you're trying to link the east and west of a country? I think it's wonderful stuff. I wish it was. I wish they'd really, really had a, a really rich scandal. It would have been much more interesting. But still, it was a pretty good scandal. Yeah, I guess so. Uh, 